Tell me you didn't pick this place just so you could play that stupid game. No, I picked this place so we could play this stupid game. This gang shit's got you a little stressed out. You need to relax. By playing skee-ball. Oh, yeah. You know, most people just smoke pot. Right. And then they go play skee-ball. Fuck it. So you hit the docks like I asked. Wait, what? After Feed Dogs concert, I called you to look into the docks and you said- Look, I gotta be honest, I was really stoned. You gotta be kidding me. Yeah, I totally am. One of the dock workers just called and said this big guy with tattoos and a scarred face was shaking people down trying to find out when some shipment was rescheduled to arrive. Why would Mero need to ask about the time of his own shipment? I don't know, maybe it got delayed. And you're sure this big guy with tattoos is Mero, not just some biker guy? I'd bet my life on it. Deal. Wait, hold up. What do you mean, deal? What's up? Are you okay? I'm fine. What's up? I was listening in on the police scanner, and the Coast Guard is reporting a lot of Brotherhood are coming towards you. You sure? I'm fine, Shondi. Suddenly I'm not so worried about the Brotherhood. I'm glad you all seem to like the new hardware the Brotherhood decided to hook us up with. You know, up until this point, we've been toying with Mero. Kill his bitch here, steal his money there. But I'm through played. We know where he lives, we have his guns. And I say it's time we take that motherfucker out. What do you think? Stop. You think it's over? Your little buddy screamed like a bitch when we trussed him up. How about you, bitch? You gonna scream? Surprised you have the balls to come alone. I never said I'd be alone.
Any last words? Go to hell. Sorry, didn't catch that. <laughs>